Hey guys, so I just bought the Blint Glass Bottle. Um, I'm gonna give it a shot for about a week. Basically give you guys on what I think about the item towards the end of the week. So, yeah, let's, let's do this and see what it's like. So here's the bottle. It basically comes with a ball on the inside. I already took the outside wrapping off of it. Um, it basically has a suction thing for anti-spills. And it's glass all over. Pretty great. Um, so far. So the top of the bottle actually does detach and apparently since it's glass it is going to be non-stink proof or basically you won't have odors inside of there whenever you leave stuff in there for a while so basically get this ball out. Ooh. So this is an interesting ball. Um, I haven't really seen it before. I've always been used to the hollow ones. Um, I guess this ball is an easier wash to do. So, yeah, interesting. So here's the ball outside of the bag. As you can tell, it's really, I mean, it's it's basic. So, easy to wash, doesn't get stuff inside of the uh, wires like the other one does. So, I'm gonna slap that back in there. It, the only thing I don't like is, it sounds really loud. Um, yeah, so I'm gonna basically make myself a protein shake now. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and make my protein shake. How am I going to get that in there? We found our first problem today. The hole at the very top is not big enough for me to put my stuff in. So now I've got to get a funnel. Um, interesting. So I'm just going to use a piece of paper. Now, let's tighten this back up. Alright, I haven't done one of these in a minute. Okay. Apparently that ball in the middle is supposed to get everything side of the walls. So, so far it's doing pretty good. I mean it's not, nothing's sticking to the sides. So when I finished shaking the shaker, it tended to uh, build up at the top right here, which is also a waste of not too much protein, but a little bit. There it is. As you can see, there's not much foam at all in there. Let me try to, there's no way to get in there. But yeah, there's no foam at all. Let's see, final result. I haven't done one of these in years. No powder, pretty good. I like the consistency, it's very good too. I mean, that could be the protein. That's nice, not much foam at all either. But yeah, that's my review on the uh, blender bottle glass shaker. So yeah, hope you guys enjoyed the video and found it helpful. Uh, links will be in the description for the bottle and the protein if you guys are interested, and uh, yeah, so I'll see you guys in the next video. Thank you.